Hi guys, Matt Thomas here at Cedar Rock Studio Guitar Gallery in Indiana, and today I've got a huge honor presenting guitar all the way from Sweden. This is a 2019 Rasmussen. This is the first Rasmussen I've gotten my hands on, and it is lovely. Now this is his Model C, so it's actually only 15 inches across, um, and it it's a very manageable guitar. It, feels so lightweight and little under the arm and it doesn't feel like it's a very long guitar either so it's really easy to just be seated with the instrument um, now it features a master grade Adirondack top over top of look at this outrageous outrageous Madagascar of rosewood or maybe we should say Madagascan rosewood but it's also bound all the way around with Madagascar. Um, and it's also got a Madagascar bridge plate um, with some ebony pins here. Now, as you get into the neck, it does have a one piece mahogany neck, um, but it's just, it feels so good. The setup on it is just so lovely. And it's got an ebony fretboard with Evo gold fret wire um, and just some simple mother of pearl inlay dots and what I should mention is there's actually only four inlay dots there's not a whole lot of um, inlay here so if you're using a capo it makes it really easy to forget where those inlay dots and just remap everything um, now it's got pretty standard specs here it's got one and three fourths at the nut and two and a quarter down here at the saddle but as you get into this head cap here you see that Madagascar head plate and looks like we have some, I'm not entirely sure what they are, but they're very unique. And I'll make sure to get a blown up picture for you guys. They got these little divots at the tip of the actual post that I had not seen before. It's really classy looking. Um, just wanted to note that even though I have no idea what they are. So Rasmussen, let me know. But let's get into what this thing sounds like. Now, typically Adirondack is not a whole lot of harmonics. It's usually just power and note forward. Not this thing. This is quite different in that it's got lots, lots of overtones and different things going on throughout it. Um, that and with the Madagascar, even though it's uh, only a 15 inch guitar, it still has lots of bass. That and what I want to mention is and what I noticed is the note is very steady. The moment you hit the note, it's there. It doesn't waver too much, which is something 
quite unique about an instrument. Sometimes the harder you hit it, it wants to raise in pitch, but it's almost as if this guitar just pushes the note and not raising the pitch. Now, it does have um, one last thing that I wanted to mention is this center strip of Madagascar that he blended in just looks so beautiful. I mean, this is a really wonderful art piece. So if you have any further questions about this really awesome Rasmussen, message Alan at cedarrockstudio.com and thanks for listening. Thank mm -hmm. you.